Jones here. Wade Jones is the owner. Do you know what this is all about, ladies and gentlemen? If you have not seen this, you are in the presence of what is known as the Elvis Cup, ladies and gentlemen. The Elvis Cup is right here. Right here, the Elvis Cup. Wade, how are you, man? Good to see you. Nice to see you. Tell us a little bit about what you got in the box. Well, what I've got here in this uh, in this little piece of luggage here is a uh, a cup that Elvis Presley drank out of here in Charlotte, 1977. I saw him when I was 13 years old, and I don't know how many of you all remember. Uh, it was last Christmas. I'm the one that sold uh, three tablespoons of Elvis's water on eBay. Wow! And then uh, I sold it for a little under 500 dollars. And then. And then the week after that, I put on another auction where I didn't want to sell the cup that, that had the water in it. I sold an appearance of the cup, and it sold for a little over $3,000. And uh, we flew out to uh, Colorado and toured with Elvis's cup. And since then, I've been uh, touring around with the cup and showing it at different kind of uh, festivals and charity events. And I've uh, teamed up with Renee here, and he's even written a song about the Elvis cup, which I think he's going to sing next. But I'm going to break it out of his case and show it to you guys. But it's the cup that Elvis drank out of at the Charlotte Coliseum in 1977. Ladies and gentlemen, aren't we glad it's not Elvis's athletic cup? Take a look at this. Yeah. Been all over the world and going places that we probably won't get to ourselves. But Wade was good enough tonight to bring it. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen, the Elvis cup. Goodness gracious, the holy grail of our Elvis people. How about it? Is the water still in there? Now the water's gone. Now what happened to the water? Did you drink it? Is that why you got such good hair? No, I, I, I sold the water on eBay. The little bit that was left, it, uh, a lot of it had evaporated. So That's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. Is somebody going to baptize their child with it? Uh, no, the person that actually won it, uh, they bought it for their mom for a, a Christmas gift. So she was a big Elvis fan. So I don't think they're going to do any baptizing with it. No. That's amazing. Well, just having the Elvis cup here. Check it out, ladies and gentlemen. And now to serenade this cup and serenade the spirit of Elvis Presley. How old would he be if the king was still with us today? Uh, 71. 71, ladies and gentlemen, right there with James Brown. They may have been half brothers, but give it up one more time for Wade, the Elvis Cup, and Rene Escorte, Rene!